Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be unboxing Buzz TV XR and XR4 S4000. Uh, pretty much in the box, they are both uh, similar. The only difference between the two is actually the specs. So the specs wise, XR4000 comes with Android 9, 2 gig RAM, 16 gig storage. So the difference is the XRS 4000 comes with 4 gig storage and 32 gig RAM. Remember, this is a DDR4, so all the older boxes, even though if they have a 2 gig RAM, they were coming with 2 gig DDR3. So it makes it much faster, and the picture quality is much better as well. Uh, so they are pretty much same, except for the RAM and the storage. Storage, you might ask, is redundant, but in this case, it's not because it does have a PVR functionality, which makes 32 gig quite good for your recordings. Okay, let's go to the unboxing of XR4000. And like I said, the XRS4000 has similar packaging. So let's go ahead. So I have it here right now. XR4000 Okay, let's see Alright Nice little booklet that comes with this one Which is quite good actually So that shows you All the functionalities of the remote Which usually customers find very good for themselves To browse through different Buttons And it gives you a small little details about the box as well. Okay, the box itself. It's a good box. Tiny little box. Design is quite good as well. So I like it. Okay, so the box has two USBs. One is USB 3.2 and also has a micro SD card as well. And the regulars, the power cable connection, the HDMI, the LAN, and the AV. And uh, remember AV inside it has a hard reset button as well. So you have, if you any case need to hard reset it, you can do it from this inside AV button. All right, so that's our box. Okay see what's inside nice packaging inside as well so they have laid it out really good inside so there's your HDMI cable the power supply and the remote control the remote control is actually I found quite interesting because it gives you quite detail and it has Some shortcut buttons which I really like as well. So this is the remote. So as you can see, it has live TV button on itself, the home button, the guide, guide which gives you full guide once you're configured with an IP TV video on demand. It takes you really directly towards the video on demand so which has movies and tv series this tv series uh, i thought that it it's good but it's when you press it on a server it doesn't quite work because everything is under a video on demand pvr functionality it gives you access to the pvr and then you have the favorite and the category so directly there are quite good shortcuts that are there for you to and also one more good thing is the search button so under channels you can search through this because there's no search link over there you just press this and you can search for all the channels and also the movies and tv shows um, other things are just this normal colored buttons which gives you access while you're on the screen they keep changing as well so according to what you're watching uh, there could be locking or favorites and all those kind of stuff. Um, I like the remote and the good thing is that the mouse on this one is quite fast as well. 
so it, it's better than other boxes all right guys if you like the video please hit the like button and also subscribe to our channel thank you